I'm Eric Singer. I am a musical roboticist. I create robotic musical instruments. Those are instruments basically that play themselves. Uh, they don't look like robots. Sometimes they don't even look like instruments. Uh, they have a whole lot of uh, engineering and science and art in them. And so I have a background in all of those things and music as well. Someone once asked me what kind of music do musical robots play? And I said, that's, well, it's like asking what kind of music does a piano play? Whatever you write for it. The instruments uh, are all unique. The, uh, at times I've produced different xylophones that have been similar to ones before and different drums that are similar and cymbals, things like that. Usually, uh, if I get a commission, the uh, client, whoever's commissioning me, has ideas on what instruments that they want and I build the robotics around them. I created an orchestrion, or an array of robotic musical instruments, for the Lido nightclub in Paris. Uh, it's a cabaret and every night they have uh, a dinner theater followed by a show and during dinner the uh, robotics, the instruments basically serve as the dinner band. The previous really uh, large-scale installation I did was for Grammy-winning jazz guitarist Pat Metheny and he came to me and he said I want to tour with a robotic band. We sat down and started planning out this array of about uh, 30, 35 different instruments that he had specified that he wanted to be part of the orchestra. The instruments themselves take a varying amount of time to create. There are certain standard mechanisms that uh, I've developed over time, ones that are used to play drums and cymbals. They're uh, kind of a standard beater mechanism. I now have a standard control box. Uh, it took at least five or six years to develop this technology to the point where uh, we could then churn out multiples and uh, the first actually the first really big commission project was by the National Gallery of Art for a Dadaist piece called Ballet Mechanique it required four bass drums, three xylophones, a gong, some uh, simulated airplane propellers and uh, a bunch of doorbells. So all kinds of different mechanisms any other kinds of instruments, percussion, whatever, that's played in a different manner than just striking or a simple shake, I will have to come up with a custom mechanism. Moving into the future, I and uh, you know, many, now many other people throughout the world, or at least a large handful of people, are creating new instruments that are played robotically.